Meet Liam and his friends. Liam is smart, but is easily bored by traditional academic classes. Sophie enjoys the book learning approach. Emily is creative. Paul is a natural with numbers. Olivia has a knack for languages. And Angela is more of a hands-on learner. They'll soon be moving up to secondary school, which means they'll have to choose new subjects. But even though Liam and his friends have different talents, they're stuck in an education system that requires them to go through and fit into a single learning path, sit in the same classroom setting for hours on end, absorb and recycle the same information and knowledge, and sit for the same standardised exams and learning by heart. We've come to believe that this traditional path is the one and only way for students to learn. So, what does this mean? Right now, this one-size-fits-all approach means that students like Liam, who are not academically inclined, are at risk of falling behind and lose out on an education. Angela's love of learning in a hands-on manner and despite her motivation to learn new things, this narrow solution may impede on that. In a few years' time, Liam and his classmates will be facing a world which will require them to be creative, able to solve problems and to adapt to changes. However, we have to admit, Liam and his friends are being offered an education system that doesn't give everyone the opportunity to succeed. Ultimately, everyone is different, but they're all getting the same. It's time to change. It's time to help the Liams and Angelas find their potential and learn in ways that they enjoy, so that they can be active citizens and lifelong learners, so that they can have a career where their qualities and potential are amplified, so that they can be happy. That's where My Journey Achieving Through Different Paths comes in. My Journey Achieving Through Different Paths will replace the current secondary school model with personalised, relevant and quality education for all students. In other words, it will be structured for students' needs and not the other way round. Here's how it will work. Alongside their compulsory core subjects, My Journey Achieving Through Different Paths will allow secondary school students to blend relevant and quality academic, applied and vocational subjects in a personalised and inclusive learning environment, enabling them to reach their full potential. Under the proposed new education system, students will still be able to follow the traditional academic path. This will not be abolished, but added to it. But they'll also be able to choose applied and vocational learning programmes as optional subjects, all under one roof. What's more, my journey achieving through different paths will give equal value to academic, applied and vocational learning programmes. So, Liam and his friends will be able to sit for different forms of learning and assessments, have the opportunity to reach the same level of qualifications and be equally employable, regardless of the blends of options they'll choose to study. The result? Unlimited and open-ended opportunities. Liam, Angela, Emily, Sophie, Paul and Olivia can learn different blends of academic, vocational and applied subjects that suit their qualities. Why shouldn't school be more fun? Why shouldn't it be more relevant to today's modern world? It's time to improve on what we have and try to build an education where children enjoy going to school every day. Where it doesn't only work for some, but works for everyone so that, from a young age, they enjoy the process of learning. They need to, because tomorrow's world will be a constant need for them to learn new things and adapt to change. This is the first step.